I think casting has been really extraordinary on this. If I just say so myself, it's not about that. No, it's about the chemistry that, that, that the casting created. We do sort of feel like uh, a family. Honest to God, Steve Bisley is like my dad. He really is. You know, and, and Heather is, is a lot like my mom. And, and you know, Jeff feel, feels like a brother. Nadine does feel like a wiser sister. It, there's this, there is really a, a sense of family. It's a thing you can't really pinpoint. You don't know why you liked something. You know, it felt, it felt comfortable, it felt familiar, it felt real. And I think that's just chemistry. It's that thing where, that beautiful stroke of luck when actors really connect. I completely adored being part of an ensemble cast because it is like a little family for six weeks and you really get to know one another really well. It was just such a good vibe. Um, I think everyone was so appreciative to be here and really believed in the story and what we were creating and, and everyone's sort of here out of love for it. Oh, it's a great cast. It's been wonderful, you know, really great. There's no egos around here. There's no egos on this film. It's just about the work. And, um, and like I say, it seems like a richer film than what I first read, you know, and that's it because it's had great life blown into it. It was great working with Josh, every, with everybody, but Josh, yeah, really, he's, uh, he's, he's the sort of heart of the film. And he, it's fabulous. He does such such good work and really interesting work too. I mean, I was absolutely gobsmacked when I was cast for the role of Cheryl because, you know, uh, uh, you know, film is not a, a medium that I, I'm, I do. And, and to be amongst such a wealth of extraordinarily experienced actors and an absolute honour to be a part of um, this production with, with uh, from Steve to you know, Nadine to Isabel and the glorious Heather Mitchell. I mean, it's extraordinary. And, uh, you know, as, as a first run out to, to have the pleasure and to, to be part of it. They're just so great to just be around. Like, just, ah, oh. I've learned, I've learned so much from just like, literally just standing there and watching them like, like do what they do. It's great, it's been so great. Um, coming into this, because it's like the first film I've ever done, I was just kind of like, oh, like, oh my God. <laughs> like, freaking out, because everyone's just so, just, oh, you've got Josh and you've got Essie and they're just so like lovely, lovely, wonderful people. So it's been like such an honor to work with them. No, I, I love the cast. Uh, I, as I said with, with Nadine, you know, what a pleasure it's been to work with her and, and Essie. Uh, you know, I've followed her career for years. And of course, Steve Bisley, you know, Goose, uh, Prousey in Frontline, um, The Big Steel, Water Rats. I just always saw him as this massive bull of a man, you know, and uh, he's like that off screen as well. You know, there's all that power and testosterone in him and you understand why he's, he's such an icon. Oh yeah, Josh Lawson. Probably the funniest man in Australia, if not the world. <laughs> Jeff Payne is he's on the same. He's probably second funniest. It's really lovely because we all have our main stories, so we we all have our own personal journey to take, which is a wonderful, wonderful thing for an actor. I mean, there's not many big group films where everyone's story is important, and this this family is it's just a lovely family. I mean. I've got Heather Mitchell and Steve Bisley as my father and mother-in-law and they're just, they're just lovely. And the whole cast is wonderful. And it's a, it's great when we all come together. And Nadine Garner, I mean, and Adam's wild. Like, everyone is just kind of joyous to be around. Steve Bisley twice has done this on this film with his welcome into the family, Anna, speech. It's a very funny speech and he does it beautifully. But he, he, he made me cry while he was doing it because he just lets these magnificent little flashes of his vulnerability and, the, and his history with the family and having broken up with Rose and come to the surface so magnificently and then straight back into his blokey bravado. He, I have been so blessed watching Steve work. I think that's been one of my favourite parts of the film. At the wedding too, Steve Bisley was across the aisle from Heather. 
and he just winked at her and I just burst into tears because it was so beautiful. To work in it with an ensemble of actors and we all got on fantastically well and all seemed to really understand the film we were in. It felt like that and I think that's due to obviously to um, Amanda, the director's sort of vision, which was very strong for the piece, I think. And I've read the script a number of times, you forget what their story is, and then when they get reminded of it, you sort of get back together and you think, oh, that's been going on while this was going on in my life. Mm -hmm. And it is um, quite exciting, sort of the floor shifting under you, because you realise that other people's lives are being challenged and changed, mm -hmm. while yours is also. So it's kind of wonderful in that way. The best thing about an ensemble cast is, you're all, it's like a band. To me, it's like a band where uh, you're working with a group of people, fitting in with them as well. You're impressed by the other work that you can see around you, so you want to match that and you want to uh, agree with the sort of style of performance that other people are putting in. It's, it's wonderful to kind of, but you do feel a bit like you're a, a satellite. So you kind of go off and onto your planet and do your little planetary acting with your storyline and then you wonder who else is in the universe and you know they're all doing great things but you don't really see it. The first group scene I think we had was in the pub and so I think mentally you're sort of going okay that's my mum and my dad and there's my two brothers and you're sort of instantly trying to weave backstory for yourself madly as an actor so that it looks legitimate. Well I love ensemble pictures and, and Australia hardly ever does ensemble pictures and I'm a massive Robert Altman fan so um, being able to be in one of these, you know, multi-narrative uh, films is is a, is a pleasure because I'm I so much love watching them, um, and also it's great for the audience too because you never actually have too much time to get sick of anyone. You, you can go straight from one person to the other, and and you get to miss people, miss characters as well, and um, and kind of be excited when they come back on, on the screen.